what are the various conditions wherein you should consider the breast implant revision surgery hi everyone i am dr ranshu mishra i am a board certified cosmetic and plastic surgeon practicing in dubai and today in this video i'll be talking to you about the various conditions where you should consider the breast implant revision surgery Let me begin with the most common condition associated uh, with these surgeries. It is the pain or discomfort after the breast implant surgery. If you feel persistent pain and discomfort uh, even after the recovery of your primary breast implant uh, surgery, it can suggest various issues like capsular contracture, pent up of some fluid which we call seroma. There can be impingement of nerves. sometimes this may also indicate uh, the rupture or leaking of an implant so in these conditions you should consult your plastic surgeon and a proper assessment should be done so that the breast implant revision surgery can be planned accordingly the other condition that can uh, be the reason for the breast implant revision surgery is when the breast implants have bottomed out if the skin and the breast tissues are not able to support Uh, the weight of the implant then these implants can fall gradually down below the breast crease this is generally seen uh, when a large uh, size implants are being placed but can also be associated with the small size implants if the supportive tissue of the breast and the elasticity of the skin overlying the breast is not good this can be seen uh, in patients who have lost a lot of weight uh, it can be because of aging or after pregnancy in certain conditions where the breast implants have rotated or displaced it may impart some asymmetry to the breast and this is another condition where you should consider the breast implant revision surgery now this happens when a very large pocket has been made and a small size of implant has been placed inside the large pocket as a result of which the implant can rotate within the pocket Uh, leading to the asymmetry or some distortion of the breast shape in some conditions there can be even lateral displacement or outward displacement of the implant that means that it is moved away from the midline of the chest and in some uh, conditions there can be a medial or an inward displacement of implant leading to cymastia if you observe any change in the shape of your breast because of the change in the uh, shape of the underlying implant it may suggest uh, capsular contracture or leaking or rupture as well as bottoming out so these changes can sometimes lead to an asymmetry in the breast and you should consult your plastic surgeon get yourself assessed so that a proper management can be done capsular contracture is another condition which requires the breast implant revision surgery whenever the breast implants are placed inside the breast the body heals by making a capsule or a scar tissue around it in some way it is good because it keeps the implant supported but if this capsule thickens it can lead to capsular contracture and certain symptoms like pain firmness and distortion of breast depending on the grade of the capsular contracture i have talked about the capsular contracture in detail in one of my previous videos you can check that out the link is given in the description box below another indication for the revision surgery is when you are not happy with the size of the breast implant i would suggest that you should wait for a minimum of 1 year after your primary surgery so you get the time uh, to heal the tissues are going to heal better and by one year the implants would settle and give you an idea about the final uh, result i hope i have been able to highlight certain conditions uh, which are important for you to know if you've got the breast implant uh, surgery done if you have more questions feel free to write in to us i will be happy to answer to see other cosmetic surgery related videos you can uh, subscribe to our channel i'm also available in other platforms like facebook and instagram thank you